The ash experiment is one of psychology's oldest and most popular pieces of research. A volunteer is told that he's taking part in a visual perception test. What he doesn't know is that the other participants are actors and he's the only person taking part in the real test, which is actually about group conformity. Please begin. The experiment you will be taking part in today involves the perception of line length. Your task will be simply to look at the line here on the left and indicate which of the three lines on the right is equal to it in length. So, for example... If you the actors right have been told to match the wrong lines. The volunteer will be monitored to see if he gives the correct answer or if he goes along with the opinion of the group and gives the wrong answer. In the first test, the correct answer is two. Uh, one. 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 Two. One. Once again, the correct answer is two. Three. 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 The ash experiment has been repeated many times and the results have been uh, supported again and again. We will conform to the group. Again, we're very social creatures. We're very much aware of what the people around us think. Uh, we want to be liked. We don't want to be seen to rock the boat, so we will go along with the group. Even if we don't believe what people are saying, we'll still go along. One. 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 People today are generally considered more self-aware and sophisticated about the effects of social influence. But are they less subject to conformity? There will be a stimulus line over here on your left-hand side. And all you'll need to do is to pick which of these lines is the same as the stimulus line. And we'll go around in order and all you need to do is state the number. We'll start with subject number one. What is your response? Two. Subject number two. Two. Subject number... On the first two trials, the Confederates matched the stimulus line to the standard line, giving the right answer. Five. Two. Subject number six. Two. Subject number seven. Two. On the third trial and thereafter, the Confederates One. give the obviously incorrect response. One. Subject three. One. Subject four. One. Subject five. One. Subject six. Two. Subject seven. One. Subject one. Two. Subject two. Two. As this subject hears the rest of the group subject give the wrong answer, he initially resists the influence of group pressure. Subject six. One. Most subjects start out defying the group, but after repeated trials, many of them begin to conform. Two. Subject four. Two. Subject five. Two. Subject six. Two. Subject seven. Two. Subject number four, what is your response? One. Subject number five. One. Subject number six, your turn. One. Their voices may drop. They may know they're giving the wrong answers, but they eventually give in.